Good afternoon and welcome to English Listens and Nur TV. Uh, what we're going to do today, we're going to start our lesson as usual with uh, review and practice of letters of alphabet. And then after that, you'll just, I'll give you a little test about recognizing a difference between capital letters and lowercase letters. But then I have a uh, paragraph for you. I will give you, teach you some new words and then you will put these words in sentences and the sentences to uh, paragraph and then you answer questions. And then at the end, I'll have a grammar lesson for you. در درس امروز مثل سابق اول شب با بو درس بسیار آسان که تکرار و تمرین عروف علف باز شروع می کنیم بعدا یک کمی درس امروز تغییر دادیم به این معنا که لغات جدید با استعمال جملات نو و در بین یک پاراگراف خدمت شما تقدیم خواهد کردم که این پاراگراف یک داستان و یک قصه بسیار ساده است که ببینیم که شما اگر او را بخوانین سوالای ما را جواب گفته می تانین یعنی یعنی بعد از اینکه شما او داستان رو میخوانین چند سوال راجع به داستان است که شما باید جواب بگوین بیاین که درس امروز خود با تکرار عروف الف با شروع بکنیم پلیز لوک ات یور اسکرینز اند پلیز ریپیت افتر می توگیدر ای بی سی دی ای اف G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. These were capital letters. Yani uruf buzurg alif ba English is ke uruf kuchakish is shakl dara ke ayn ami talafuz naam daran monta shaklishan tahir mi khoram. Wo moshma ira barha tekrar kardim. Dar ik qismat mek tamrin bisar kuchak daran boshma ke dar yak qatar ma wala dar ek sutun ma uruf buzurg daram wo dar sutun baadish uruf kuchak as. توقعی ما شما ایست که عروف بزرگ با عروف کوچک وصل کنیم یعنی you see that on this column we have all capital letters and then on this column we have lower case letters my expectation is that you will connect the capital to the lower case so like this one is what first of all read it what, what do you call this letter this is what this is T capital T which one of these is capital T so you connect that with that one. Let's do the first one. So this is T and this one is T. So T, T. How about this one? What do you call that in English? What's the name for this? This is J. Okay. Now find the lowercase J on this column. So J, which one is J? This one, this one, this, 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 or this? The correct answer is this one. So we connect those two. J, J. How about this one? What do you call this in English? It's called G. See, this was J. This is G. Now, which of these is G, lowercase g? The correct answer is what? This one. So we connect those two. G, G. Capital, lowercase. Look at this one. What do you call that in English? It's called H. Okay. Now, which of these is H? The correct answer is H and here, H. Now, it's becoming easier and easier because we have more letters, you know, uh, uh, marked already. This one is called what? This is E. Okay. Now, find E over here for me. Which one of this? This is left. Is this E? Is this E? Is this E? Is this E? And so these are the letters left. The correct answer is what? E, E. This is lowercase. This is capital letter. E, E. How about this one? What do you call that in English? You call it Q, Q. And which one is Q here? So there are not many letters left. This one, this one, and this one. There are three letters left. Which one is Q? The correct answer is this one, 
Q, Q. How about this one? This is called what? Capital B. Now, which one is B? There's one is here, and then this one. The correct answer is that one, B, B. This one should be easy because this is the only one left. Uh, all you need to do is what? To find out which one, what you call this. This is the very first letter in English, and so it's called what? A, and we connect that with that one. So I want you to look at these and repeat after me together. T, T. J, J. G, G. H, H. E, E. Q, Q. B, B, and A, A. Now let's go to the next part. What I have for, for you here is I have two words. They look alike. Some of them are exactly the same. Some of them are not. There may be some differences. So if they are exactly the same, then you circle S, meaning it's the same. If they are not exactly the same, then you circle D. در این قسمت من خدمت شما دو کلمه را تقدیم می کنم که کلمات بسیار با هم شباهت دارند در بعض موارد اینا عین می کلمه است اصلا در صورتی که اینا عین کلمه باشند عین عین معنا را داده باشند عین اسپل داشته باشند در صورت شما دور حرف اس خط می کشین یعنی معنی چیزی که اینا the same است یعنی عین عین چیز هستند اگر فرق داشته باشند در صورت شما دور دی را خط می کشین که معنی چیزی که اینا فرق دارند different هستند بیم توجه بکنید لغت اول هم ای جی جی ای جی جی اس در اینجا یک اس اس در اینجا نیست پس اینا یه این لغت نیستن میگیم که وان دیفرند در مینینگ از دیفرند ایگ مانای یک تخم است و ایگز مانای پلورال مور دن وان دی یو سی که دک دی یو سی که این کلم است فقط تفاوتی چیز که یکیش به دی کلان نشته شده دیگهش به دی خورد اما این کلمات است این معناس هیچ کدام فرق نداره کی سرکل وان اس سیم هاو بوت دس وان اف آی آر ای اف آی آر ای اس وید اس در در دس دس دیفرنس سو وی سرکل وان دی دیفرنت a n t a u n t ant 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 what pronunciation is different and the meaning is different the spelling is different you circle d this one is f l a g f l a g exactly the same except for one the first one starts with capital letter the second one starts with a lowercase letter, but they're exactly the same word, exact same pronunciation, exact same meaning. The answer is what? S. The last one, C-A-R and C-A-T. So they're two different words, car, cat. Then we circle one, D. Now please look at these words, repeat after me together. لطفاً بعد از من این کلمات را تکرار بکنیم. egg eggs different duck duck same fire fires different ant ant different flag flag same car cat different. Now let's go to the next page. In the next page, as I said before, we are going to read words, we are going to read sentences, and we are going to read paragraphs. First we start with words. I show you a picture, and then the meaning is there, and then we will use these words in sentences and make a little short paragraph. در این قسمت مثل که خدمت شما در حوال عرض کردم ایست که ما در حوال یک تعداد لغات خدمت شما تقدیم میکنم با تصاویر و او لغات میخوانیم با اصلاح عروفش جنگ مندازیم میخوانیمش بعدا این کلمات در یک لغات 
یک پاراگراف استعمال میشه ایران شما با جملات میبینین و بعد از سوالا رو راجع به اون پاراگراف جواب میدین Let's look at the words first Now this word is what a person who farms so what do you call this people here that they work on a farm see this is a farm it's actually a rice farm the person who works there is what farmer farmer لطفاً بعد از من تکرار بکنید farmer farmer he is a farmer he is a farmer farmer please repeat farmer okay now let's go to the next one now this is what this is a person and then this is his wife and these are the two children so if a person has wife and children this person is called what married please repeat married he is married she is married please repeat married married he is married she is married this is one child this is another child so they have two children a daughter and a son please repeat married he is married she is married now this person is what he is not married if a person is not married doesn't have a wife and children he's called what single he is single single married he is single now this is what this is the age this is what an old man old he is an old man old man an old man we say an old man because what because old starts with o and so we say an old man how about this one this one is not an old man he is a young man young man young old he is a young man now here we see countries big countries small countries so here we see what uh, different countries russia is a country here china is a country here afghanistan is somewhere around here and australia is another country united states is a country canada a country one country two countries money countries countries please repeat countries countries now this is a farm farm this is what a small farm see a farmer works on a farm farm a small farm this is also a farm but this is what this is a big farm a small farm a big farm this is a big farm this one is what small farm this is a small farm this one is what a big farm now how about this word now here what we have is what we are going to read uh, uh, these words in sentences this is the picture of this man Ahmad is his name and here is what he says about himself. Dari qismat ma'ami kalimat ra ke moshma khandim id dar jumalat raje be shakhsi ke Ahmad namesh ast istifada mikonim. Ir az zuban ami shakhs migim ke Ahmad ast. My name is Ahmad. My name is Ahmad. I am a farmer. So this guy is what? A farmer. I am married. My father and brothers are farmers too. My father and brothers, with S, more than one, brothers are farmers too. My mother and sister are not farmers. My brothers and sisters are young. My mother and father are old. 
Our farm is small. It is in Kabul, Afghanistan. Afghanistan is a small country. It is in Asia. Let's read this again, and then you'll answer questions about it. My name is Ahmad. I'm a farmer. I'm married. My father and brothers are farmers too. My mother and sisters are not farmers. My brothers and sisters are young. My mother and father are old. Our farm is small. It is in Kabul, Afghanistan. Afghanistan is a small country. It is in Asia. We need to take a break right now. After the break, we're going to continue. And so please stay with us. Let's take a short commercial break. Thank you.